Hey, do you mind? Huh? Whoa. Oh. She's not annoying. What do you mean she's not annoying? What is wrong with you? <laughs> Her voice she annoyed said me. said one thing. <laughs> Her voice annoyed me. You're the opposite problem of someone simping. <laughs> I'm just immediate hatred. <laughs> yeah. You don't even know her. If it's dangerous, how can you just leave me here? Aren't you my she needs help. Maybe armor? you shouldn't be so well? needy. N Knight, you've got the wrong She's idea. She's playful. Oh my gosh. You literally had a wink. Just kidding. See? You get out God, of Rain. <laughs> so quick to judge. Yo, what's going on, everybody? It's Zombie here. Today, we're back with another Dream Rock Distance video. Which, by the way, I guess I didn't say this. 3D... They thought they were being clever by using a name that had three D's in it. Dream, drop, distance, three D's, three DS. They thought it was yeah. super cool. Anyways, I think it's clever. I kind of like it. Uh, it's quite clever, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So I'm into it. I thought I'd share that real quick. Um, but anyways, let's just jump into this. All right, All right. here we are. Oh, whoa, whoa. You wanted to say something. What's up, Ray? <laughs> I was just going to say, honestly, when you brought up like the three DS thing, you said three D's. Um when we started it, and I was like, oh, is it because there's 3Ds? And I didn't really register that you're talking about the 3DS. <laughs> well, yeah, that's why. Yeah, I didn't, I didn't sink we... in. I forget that exists. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm confused what you're confused. Wait, did you understand what I said then? <laughs> I did, but when you started the first episode, <laughs> uh -huh. and you said 3Ds, I was like, yeah, there is 3Ds, and then I was like, what? <laughs> oh, like you didn't know I was talking about. It, it took me a minute to understand you were talking about 3DS. <laughs> oh, oh, okay. Because I'm. Dumb. I follow. <laughs> so, what is this? No, I. I wanted to hit the link what? portal. Oh. Oh, I have to X. Okay. Borrow these spirits and return. The return. The spirits will return home after a certain amount of time. No? I'm good. I, I, I'm gonna have to read oh. up on this between Joshua, recording sessions. <laughs> why don't they ever attack you? They being dream eaters? They won't go after you unless you're a dreamer. Which is funny because I've got plenty of dreams. But they're definitely attacking me. They're not attacking him. So, so rude. You think I'm a dreamer? Every human being is a dreamer. I had a friend but you, apparently. who said he never dreamed of anything, but it turned out that his were the most powerful dreams of all. You sort of remind me of him. Why don't Who's that? your dreams shape? In this world, they take form as dream eaters, which can become great allies. All right, come, come Roy Bat recipe. Okay. So now he can he can get a he can get a dream eater now. Do not give me another tutorial on this, please. <laughs> oh wow! So it carries over, even though. He, wait. Oh, I can't make that one. Okay, I see. So it's like some of these are Sora's and some are Riku's, I guess. I guess, or I have to get another recipe in order to make it. Yeah. Hold that. All right, and we got a Zubat. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Yeah, it's, this is Zubat. I'm gonna name it Zubat. <laughs> yeah, you should. Zoo! Uh, zoo! Nope. Zoo bat. <laughs> bat. There we go. Done. There we go. It has more eyes than Zubat, though. It it has it, darkness spheres. Uh oh. What do you mean it has more eyes than Zubat? Zubat has no eyes. What? It uses echolocation uh, like now, a bat. Joshua. Hmm? How have What's I done this in that? Oh god. Another guy. Be Another character. How many times do we have to go over this? You've been tricked by that rogue in the black coat. What? Black coats? But that's... I'm oh. telling you, oh. you made a friend of our oh. <laughs> no. Just kidding, alright? Your inverse psychiatry ain't gonna work. Let's go! Dream Eaters! I hate his hat. <laughs> yeah. What? His hat is over the top. Oh, I just hate work. skulls. His outfit so. was different. <laughs> I just hate skulls. That's really why I hate it. Tutorial linking with spirits. 
I'll watch it later. <laughs> I don't want to do a tutorial. Okay, now we just fight. I like it. Cool. I can't decide who's got the worst coloring. What, the bad what do you mean? pandas or the good pandas? Uh, good pandas. I, that's. Well, this isn't a good panda though. I guess there's another panda. But I, f I find all of the good guys being less cool. We've talked about this before that we, we don't like rainbows. And that is yeah. literally what all of our dream eaters are. So it's like... Yeah. Uh, it's, it's kind like, of nauseating. It, it, it's a cacophony of colors. It's like, just like, yeah. pick pick a couple colors and go with it. Make them kind of go together. The enemies, uh, the, the dream eaters and stuff would be way cooler if, if they were like that. But they don't do that. And it's like, oh my god. I don't want to fight with rainbows. Is it because they were trying to be you know like... What? Oh, Forget yeah. it. This is stale, yo. Oh god. <laughs> well, that was a friendly panda because it was his panda. All right, cool. I'll shut up. Yeah. Want to protect the one person who matters. I know the feeling. Oh no, my head. So sleepy. Oh. None of you, neither of you can help him? Okay. No, oh, there's slightly that happened. Flashback, Keyblade War. The Keyblade. <laughs> Peace. Long ago, in the age of fairy tales, the world was filled with light, a gift many believed from an unseen power known as Kingdom Hearts. You see, age of fairy Kingdom tales, Hearts he says. was protected by its counterpart, the Keyblade, so that none could he didn't ever say hands it. on its no, he didn't. But in time, the world was overrun by legions who wanted the light all for themselves, and the first shadows were cast upon the land. These warriors crafted keyblades in the image crafted? of the original keyblade, and waged a great war over Kingdom Hearts. We call this the Keyblade War. But though the war extinguished all light from the world, the darkness could not reach the brightness inside every child's heart. With that light, the world was remade as we know it today, with countless smaller worlds shining like stars in the sky. As for the real Keyblade, it did not survive the battle. The two elements that created it, one of darkness and one of light, shattered into twenty pieces, Seven of light, thirteen of dark. Thirteen! There's a number I am telling you they love thirteen. The source of all light, the one true kingdom hearts. It was swallowed by the darkness, never to be seen again. As long as it remains there, even the brightest world will have its dark corners. After all, light begets darkness, and darkness is drawn to light. So true. For so true. Reason, yeah. Some decided to use the Keyblade, a weapon designed to conquer the light, to defend the light instead. These were the first heroes of the Keyblade. See, so that's like the real thing behind Keyblade Wheelers. Not, not, you know, to use the light to defeat everything. It's like to defend what light we have, not to destroy darkness, you know? That's, yeah, that's but what then they keep they keep trying to destroy darkness, and it just doesn't it doesn't work. No, 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 no. They're defending the light. Ericus was trying to destroy darkness. That little light whore. We are just <laughs> defending the light. That's all we're doing. He is a light whore. <laughs> yeah, he is. Kingdom Hearts. So this is just like inf this is information we all know. So that's why I'm not going to the glossary and reading up on that. Oh, no, Rexor. That's, that's fair. Oh, hello. Huh? Where is he? Where'd he go? How long was I sleeping for? Why did you leave me here? They're both gone. Before what? I fell asleep, uh -huh. Miku said that he and that creep in the coat had a deal. That skank. But what was the deal? <laughs> Are the two of them in league? <laughs> can't be right. I just did. I guess I should <laughs> just take a look around. 
All right, here here's where we learn the most crazy mechanic between this, which is dropping between characters. In this game, you will alternate between Sora and Riku to progress through the story. With this drop button, hence dream drop distance. To drop or switch between characters, just select drop on the pause screen or the main menu. But there's the, a drop gauge that continues to de deplete here. Sleep and the other negative statuses will cause your drop gauge to drain more quickly. Okay. And so when it runs out, you'll enter bonus time and drop list will appear more often. After the bonus time ends, you will drop into the next character. So when this happens, it'll force me into the other character. Okay. So apparently I, I can choose it and then it also forces me. Yeah. So that kind of thing will happen in fights. And if it happens in a boss fight, you have to restart the boss fight. Oh, so great. don't want that to happen. Yeah, Ugh. yeah, that sounds really bad, so. Fire. They get really mad, don't they? I thought it was just that one enemy, but I think like they all get mad. Where's the other enemy? You know, I don't see any more baddies. What's up to you, you ugly? Uh, oh, way up here is pink dots on me. Yeah, I saw it towards the top. Okay, I got a chest. I got a block of chocolate. God, why does everything have to be so, like, cutesy and whimsical and whatever in this game? Not it's whoa. like dreams, whoa. and everything in dreams and sleeping, I guess, is meant to be cutesy, but sometimes you have nightmares. <laughs> that are apparently also cutesy. <laughs> yeah, no, they, they, the, the, the nightmare aspect probably should have been more, uh, you know, scary. Oh, here it is. Yeah, I agree. And then the, 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 when they become spirits, maybe they turn more whimsical like this. You've gone again. Uh, oh, all right. I, I, what, why am I still in combat? Is that pink guy? God, though? can you guys just all show up in the same place? Why do I have to scour the map for you guys? I should have a look around. I'm trying, but I'm constantly in combat. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're cool. We're cool. All right. I think so. Uh, bond. No, I don't want to bond. Mm -hmm. Okay, so can I create the spirit now? Okay, I can. Oh, okay. I can if I want to. I'm going to not right now. <laughs> but ability links. Okay, yeah. So these are these are like the ability tree of the last game. And I guess uh, this is how we get up certain abilities. So this is Curia. Ability tree of the last game. Yeah. So like this has Leaf Bracer on it. That was an ability tree. No, there wasn't. I, I'm sorry. It was just like an ability thing. It was just like it's like this. It's like this. Oh, thing. okay. And oh, we, had to, we, <laughs> we had we had to combine commands to get abilities. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. This 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 yeah. game is like linked to our little little furry boys. These are all just furries. This game is just made for furries. Uh, all mm -hmm. right, let's go. This Wait, oh, I can't go that way. What no, you have to look around. Apparently, I, I don't know. I did look around. Where else do you want me to look around at? I don't know. What's that? Is it called? It's called flow motion, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. It, keeps, it keeps reminding me of um, Infamous yeah. First Light. <laughs> oh, I can hit this apparently. Ooh. Oh, that's a callback to the first game a little bit. We had an electricity thing that we had to do there. Yeah, I was just thinking about that. <laughs> yeah, that's interesting. I'm enjoying the first game nostalgia. Yeah, right? Go check it out, everybody. Shameless no. clickbait. Not clickbait, Angry. sorry. Shame of plug. <laughs> That's the one. <laughs> yeah, not clickbait. That mailbox My looks unhappy. Uh, I'm sure it's fine. Oh, here's a, what's this thing? What is this? Oh, it's like a ladybug, maybe? Bug thing? What? I don't know what it is. I don't, yeah. So we, we do get an, oh, I, I, I've been meaning to tell this every time the cutscene pops up. Those characters that we're seeing are from another game. Um, they are, they are from a, a game called The World Ends With You, which is different than The End of the World from KH1, different from The World That Never Was in KH2. This is, this is another thing that is, <laughs> that, uh, is a separate game made by the game creator here, 
Nomura, who also directed that game. And, uh, yeah, so I, I think some of the music that I'm like, oh, this is a bop. I think it's from that game, the, those okay. songs. So, so what, what are they from again? What, game, what thing are they from? They are from The World Ends With You. Okay. And that's a, a separate thing, like game or what? what it's, yeah, it's a different game, different for franchise. Okay. It's kind of like Final Fantasy being in this. It's like It really isn't to do with a story. It's just a yeah. cameo, essentially. Okay. Oh, I Moogle. like how you, you. I like how you're fine. Oh, Moogle. So, so don't distract me like that. <laughs> uh, let's say, like, I like how you're fine with the Final Fantasy characters being in it, even though they're from other games. But then you see the Disney characters, and you're like, mm, no, nah, they're not original characters. Yes. I guess they are. They are original. They were made I hate originally. Them. And that that's not the argument I ha I make with Disney. I'm like, I hate these characters. I don't, I don't want Disney in my game. They're so, like, unnecessary. We don't go to Final Fantasy worlds. We go to freaking Disney worlds. Final Fantasy just make cameo appearances. Disney characters make make me waste my time. <laughs> yeah, they are sometimes a huge waste of time, but other times they're important. And, and let's be honest, Final Fantasy characters are way cooler than freaking Disney characters. Uh, they both are quite cool for different reasons. No. No, yes. cancelled. Yes. Cancelled. You can't just cancel my opinion. Cancelled. Or I can no. buy a prickle mane. I think that's the thing you were relating to that paddle. In okay. A heavy rep? Sure, why not? It's cheap, a right? A heavy rep? What the fuck's a heavy rep? I don't know. We're about to find out. <laughs> Create a spirit. Oh, it's that thing. Oh, it's the lizard. They're all oh level my. two, so you got... You guys Go all level on. up together. I love Any more little face. Fighting. Which one? This one or this the, one? The, prick, the prickle mane. I hate its face. Those eyes <laughs> suck. <laughs> its eyes are the best part. It's very much cat-like, too. I hate it. I hate cats. All right. Anyways, moving on. I can't wait to shove you off my team. Even though you are part dog, but you're not dog enough for me. All right. Anyways, where are we going? This way? This way? Going this way? Maybe? Oh. I'm I'm really curious how I'm gonna like these uh, mechanics of these dream eaters. As of right now, I don't know how much I like it. I don't know how much they're really helping me, but I suppose it's better than nothing. I guess. I don't know. Sometimes I do just see him standing there while you're fighting everything. <laughs> yeah, and he's popping up these balloon bubbles, and it's like, okay, do something with those. Maybe you have to level them up. Yeah, may, may, maybe I have to. I don't know have a more useful companion. Alright, let's... I must have gone the wrong way. No, but didn't, that, didn't that just take you back? Okay. Oh, right. This yep. way, maybe? <laughs> no, not that way. That's not a way to go. What the hecky? I used the potion by accident. Gosh. What does it want you to do? I... I don't... Maybe it's telling me to go switch characters to freaking Riku? I don't know. God, the freaking slow motion! I don't want to do it! Stop doing it all the time! You I'm just trying to. It? I'm just trying to roll for speed. That's all I'm trying to do. Yeah. That is lower down than it was in Kingdom Hearts One. It 100 percent is. <laughs> I was thinking the same thing. <laughs> you took forever trying to parkour up there. Uh, I don't. I don't see what I'm supposed to do here. So I'm gonna go switch over to the other character, I guess. The other character. He has a name. The better character? <laughs> Drop? I was gonna say Riku, but sure. What's this say? For, forecast. What? Why is there a for... What is the... The weather looks like it's raining pandas, based on the <laughs> image on the left there. Heavyweight uh, bulk sighted, so I'm guessing it's saying, oh, there's more big enemies? I don't know. Whatever. I'm gonna go into this little thing here. Droplets. Um, okay. Uh, what? Earn bonuses with drop? Okay. Um, collect these droplets, find these doggish cat things sighted. Okay. <laughs> but, but, uh, um, I've, I've learned, I've been told by the internet that Balloon is the most OP thing in this game, so I'm going to get that. <laughs> so, yes. What, are you going to, like, collect them and make a house, like, up? What are you going to do with the Balloon? <laughs> I'm going to murder things. 
<laughs> he just passed out on his front. <laughs> okay, so we're getting cutscene. That seems promising. What happened? It does. Did I fall asleep? Seems like it. Where are Joshua and Beat? Hey, do you mind? Huh? Whoa. Oh. Another world ends with you, character. She's not annoying. Hope you're ready for more. What do you mean she's not annoying? What is wrong with you? <laughs> Her voice she annoyed me. She said one thing. <laughs> Her voice annoyed me. She, but you don't think freaking Donald's annoying? Shut up, Ray. No. I'm going to cancel you. You're canceled. I'm canceled. I don't think you. character's annoying. God, she said one thing. She's running away from some enemies. But her voice is annoying. My God. She's got a little cat thing in her arm. Okay, you freaking kind of like cats. I didn't see her. I just, well, I just saw yeah, you judged her by her voice. God. Yes, yes I did. <laughs> Lord almighty. You're the opposite problem of someone simping. I'm just immediate hatred. Yeah. You don't even know her. I know, but her voice in that instance annoyed me, okay? And then you saw her cat and you're like, oh, that's kind of cute, actually. Oh, that's kind of cool. Yeah, well, we, we should get to know her. She, she can have a cat and still be annoying. I know. But I don't know but... if she's annoying yet. I'm just saying that one thing annoyed me. Oh, that was the first thing out of your mouth. First, first thing. I think she's annoying. Uh-huh. I probably thought Kyra was annoying when I first saw her. Uh, first uh, saw her. <laughs> wait, what? I said first saw her, and then I was like, oh, Sora. Because you oh, saw her. I see what you did. Yeah. It's not enough to make me laugh, but... It's somewhat clever. I'll give you credit for that. Well, okay. I don't... Yeah. Cre credit Thank there. You. Thank you. New, new drop bonus is unlocked. Cool. I'll figure out what that does between... uh Drops. Between recording sessions. No. <laughs> well, if you Seriously? drop again, you might figure Thanks. it out. I'm Shiki. How about you? Riku. Thanks, Riku. Sure. Is she knowing you now? Hey, that's it? Her voice is a bit... Up a girl but... and then just Are you say, kidding me? And walk off? I'm bad at this. Sorry. He didn't. He didn't do Look, anything. It's not safe here. You should go home. If it's dangerous, how can you just leave me here? Aren't you my she needs help. Maybe armor? you shouldn't be so well, fucking needy. <laughs> Knight, you've got the wrong She's idea. She's playful. Oh my gosh. You literally had a wink. Just kidding. See? You get out. God, rain. <laughs> so quick to judge. You remind me of this guy. No way. Well, good thing we met. Yeah, great. Do you think Aerith's annoying? She has the same no, kind of vibes she's, as Aerith. She's great. Aerith's great. I, I, don't I, I don't even, I've never even played the world's end with you and I'm defending this character I don't know. Oh my God. <laughs> I'm sorry, she just, she did some, she did some things that just annoyed me and her voice is kind of shrill. It's this, Aerith is the same way. She's, no, she literally has a... Her voice isn't shrill. I I feel like their voices are very similar to me. And they also have the same playfully tone. And and Riku reminds me of, of Cloud. Like I'm seeing I I yeah, see a I lot of correlations. I can see it. I just I'll give her more chances. It's just right now she's a bit annoying. By golly! If it was a guy, you wouldn't be annoyed. <laughs> I, Cause guys have less annoying voices. <laughs> Jeez. If I was a guy, I wouldn't care like the current guys. Josh ladies, I got you out there. I got you, ladies. <laughs> oh, I got you. This this should be working the other way around based on society, but but uh, this is cool. <laughs> I'm quite happy hearing men talk, and some women just need to not open their mouths. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> Well then. It's it's correct. It's right that most guys have naturally like their their voices are deeper and not as shrill. Yeah, that's typically. So, yeah. When I hear a shrill voice, which you usually find with women, it kind of irritates me. <laughs> okay. I have
have well, reasons. <laughs> All right. I'll take your word for it. So where are we supposed to go? I don't know. She was all about, oh, you gotta protect me, and then I didn't, you got annoyed. <laughs> oh, here's the thing. I don't know if you want to do that thing, though. Is this the way I can go? No, no, I can't go this way. Oh, I have haste. He gave me haste? Oh, heck yeah. Whoa. Ooh. Oh, that must be the, the, the abilities they talked about that I skipped that tutorial. Remember that? I remember that. <laughs> I don't remember that because you skipped it, so it didn't stick in my brain. This guy gives me the, gives me a haste. I like that. Ventus could use you. <laughs> yeah, he could. Oh, look at these little lizards. Are these things colored different than the last ones we saw? I don't think so. Maybe. Okay. I don't know why they look a little different to me. Also, I just had a thought. Now, now you're gonna find someone in the comments telling me that I've got a shrill <laughs> I I almost said that to you, but I'm like, nah, we'll leave it. But comments can go for it, and you said it, so whatever. <laughs> I I've heard my voice a few times while watching some of the videos back. I don't think it's shrill, but maybe that's just my opinion. I also do not think it's shrill. If I'm a I'm if I'm gathering what you mean by shrill correctly, I'm gonna say no. Yay. <laughs> Maybe it's shrill when I saw uh, Sora as a lion, though. Honestly, I think when you say shrill, you just mean higher pitched. Which, I mean, first off, it's kind of mean of you to feel like that towards me because they can't control how their voice sounds. <laughs> so that's kind of a jerk move. But, uh, uh whatever. Well, it's just... Just, I mean, like, like <laughs> the way people sometimes talk when it's like, especially with voice acting, it can be squeakier because they've made it squeakier and it's kind of irritating. Whereas when they talk normally, they might not be that high and sometimes squeaky. sure. I don't think that the voice actress you're referencing just there had that. At the very least, people do sound like that just normally. <laughs> Oh my god, I don't know how it... It's not their fault, I know, and they're probably great people, but he would get on my nerves. Man. Well... Uh, that's a you problem, Ryan. <laughs> it's oh, a no. me problem, I'm not saying it's their problem, it's definitely my problem. Mm -hmm. Problem? Problem. <laughs> it's their problem. It's, it's not their problem, it's my problem. <laughs> yeah, exactly. It's definitely a me problem. Uh -huh. I feel like I'm allowed to have that problem of it just gets in my ears and I can't... Yeah, I can listen to a fire alarm just fine. <laughs> yeah, no, then you're not valid. Cancelled. <laughs> Cancelled. Uh, this- I have- I have never been more confused about what to do in a game. Blow off? I'm blowing you off? Wow. Okay. I don't want that on my history. <laughs> Now people are going to be like, wow, remember the time when Zombo blew off a panda? No, don't. Oh, no. I don't need that. I don't need that game. Please. I mean, you have control if it makes it in the video. <laughs> it's gotta, it's gotta make it. And future Zombo has that power and future Zombo will 100% make me look like a fool. He yeah. loves that. He loves doing that. No, don't freaking, I thought I could kill him before he punched me, I'll be honest. Intrepid Fragment, I did that to make a new, uh, a little, little guy. So, do I just drop back now? Like, I'm so confused what happens here. I don't know. You can... Oh, I have a map? I actually have a map? Oh. Objective, track down Joshua and beat. Yeah, but how? I mean, when, you know that front door that you were at? Riku was heading right in like the cutscene before he was interrupted by whatever her name was. So I can go that way as Sora, but I can try it. Maybe you can go that way as Riku. I can tell by my map. Oh, I can. Okay. I guess I guess what I need to keep in mind then is they can make, be able to go to different areas at different times. So I gotta okay keep that in mind. All right. Thank you, Rain. Big brain. You're welcome. Big brain. And big brain. Also, good job for remembering the cutscene. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, sometimes you don't remember the cutscenes. <laughs> yeah. Well, you gotta remember, I have a lot of cutscenes in my head, so it's hard to... <laughs> yeah. 
I'm trying to I'm remember the one we just saw. With like a blank canvas. Right. <laughs> Though I will say, as I, I say this like every game we play, it's been like at least six years since I've seen these cutscenes, so. Uh, no. Eventually, you're going to get to the point where you're like, oh, so it's been at least seven years since I sent these cutscenes. <laughs> yeah, honestly, though, yeah, 2023. Up. Yeah. Um, this is, I just want to mention before I go further and more enemies spawn, this is a new area of Traverse Town we've been to, so that's, that's kind of cool. I, I like that. I, s I see some graffiti. I was going to say, graffiti artists were here. I blame B. <laughs> I was going to say that, but I'm like, I feel like that's stereotyping, so I wasn't going to say it, but you said it, so. <laughs> now I don't look like the, the, the mean person. You are, you are racking yourself up today, aren't you? <laughs> like, <laughs> <laughs> Joshua, he seems like a bit of a joke. Oh, oh. Yeah, yeah he, he's a bit of a tool, I said, it seems. I said the stereotype is a joke. <laughs> okay. This, that was her excuse, everybody. I don't actually <laughs> think it was B. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well. One of us has a filter. <laughs> you know oh, that's my friend. That's my friend. Yes, I do know this about you. It gets me into trouble all the time. Uh, alright, map. So that way is just the thing. Oh, wait, so none of these ways are the way. I have to get up top. How do I get up top? I don't you jump? I don't oh, see no. a way. I can't jump that high. You just way up there. <laughs> uh, do that thing where you jump from one wall to the other wall to back to the other wall and you slowly oh, go Oh, yeah, you know what? That is actually 100% how I was supposed to do that. <laughs> Wait, seriously? Yes, actually, 100% that's exactly how I was supposed to do that. Yeah, joking. <laughs> well, you helped me. That's 100% right. Good so job, kidding. Rain. I'm Rain, so kidding. Rain's doing better with this game than I am, I'm just gonna be honest. <laughs> She's doing way better than me. I'm so lucky I'm not playing this by myself or people would rage at me for not knowing what was happening. I just lucked out with that one, though. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I mean, yeah, that's, a, that's, that's what this gap, is for right uh, here. Yeah. Like, well, maybe not that location specifically, but yeah, I, I like think you're 100% right. Like mm. uh, 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 okay, maybe not that location. Maybe you need, yeah, like a maybe, maybe I do. Actually, maybe I do need that location over here. No, I think about it. This is the location. Seems, seems full enough. Oh, oh, God, stupid. Okay. <laughs> oh. We'll just both be just wrong, and you can't actually do it this way. That could be a thing. And my maybe joke not. is now valid as a joke. <laughs> maybe not. Maybe it is a joke. Yeah, I, I can't get... Uh, I can't seem to get air with it. I do not freaking know. I mean, maybe I need to do these link things? I guess I can try one. I just... It seemed like extracurriculars, and I don't... I don't like to do extra work. <laughs> Me. Right. Did I not get that chest before? I thought I got that chest. I don't it's, know. It's so hard, too, because, like, challenge failed. All right, well. Screw okay. you. Well, they're not supposed to get hit, or what? I have no clue. Um. Eventually, I I'm just going to run out of drop the stuff, and you're just going to be like, no, but you can go back to Sorina. <laughs> pretty, pretty much. That's probably gonna be what happens. My gauge will deplete. Oh, why don't you go up there? On the right. Behind you. Up there. Oh! Wait. Uh, oh. Oh. Oh, so that didn't show up on the map. I see. Whoa, whoa, what are you doing? Oh, this is an oh, owl. It's like an owl. <gasps> Rain loves owls. I love owls. Okay. Oh okay. my god. He's so cute. That was too ugly color to be cute, Rain. No, the colors, were, uh, the colors don't matter. It was cute. All right, all right. Let me, let me get, I'll get a little bit of a look at the owl for you. Let me, let me, all right. All right, hold up. I finished it. Yay. But I, challenge failed. So what do I win? You, you finished the Nothing. challenge, but you failed the challenge. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much. Okay, so I got to really look. It doesn't, I've been relying too much on this map, I guess. Like, it doesn't tell me I can go that way. Yeah, use your eyeballs. All right, well, so why do I have a map then? Let me um, look over here then, because I don't I trust don't it why. now. <laughs> You've got trust issues. I d look, look! I, uh, <laughs> uh, uh, <laughs> it lied is to me. Gonna, you lied gonna take to you, me. Is this just going to take you all the way back around to the other exit? Oh, no. 
Uh, Maybe? Yes. Yes. No? Is this different? I don't know. <laughs> what is that? That's me. Oh, that was a bad. But okay, whatever. Well, at least you're higher up now. Yeah. I got thunder. Oh, I love that spell. Uh, oh. Oh no, I'm gonna drop in 30 seconds. Cause I suck. Where am I? I I've do. I have not been here, right? This is new. Yeah. No, it's, it's the same map. Look. Oh, I'm down I'm just there. Just down at the bottom. Okay. Well, I'm gonna drop, and I'm gonna lose where I was, so that'll be fun. Oh, I've been here. No, this is- I have been here. Yeah. Alright. Um... Well, there's a chest that I wanted to get. Yeah, I'm buying three seconds. I guess that waterway would take you to it, then. So, and then I- can I- if I want, then I can just, like, immediately drop back, then. Probably. Uh, another balloon command? A training toy that lets you lets you bat balloons around with your spirits. Oh my god. Magic gain, attack gain, increased strength, lasts until you drop, and scales with your level. Well, wouldn't a balloon thing... Oh, it's just a training... Oh, it's just a thing to play with your freaking pet. I don't care about that. Screw that. Confirm. We're gonna make it so I don't drop again so quick. Man, I don't want to play with my pet. Are you kidding me? What do you, th what do you think? What do you think this is? <laughs> Pokemon? Yeah, Can Pokemon. I have a picnic? <laughs> yeah, I don't think I ever had a picnic when I played through Scarlet. <laughs> I didn't. I never saw you do one from what everything I saw, but... I, I've never ended that. Friendship levels and stuff. Yo, you say that, but the, one of the first mods I, I got was Jiggly, Jiggly Buff, or Jiggle, Jiggly Buff. Yeah, is it Jiggly Buff? Igly, I think. Igly, Igly Buff. Isn't Igly it? Buff. Igly Buff. Thank you. And and um, that's a friendship evolution, and I got that thing leveled up pretty quick. It wasn't that hard. Yeah, I mean, just the, it's really easy to be friends with your Pokemon, <laughs> but also yeah. it's a way to get eggs. Yeah. See, this way's blocked off. Okay. Interesting. All right, and I gotta assume everything on my map is a lie. Yeah. Everything is a lie. Yeah, it's just a general guidance to be like, this is this area. We woke up here. This is the last place we, we were, and that, we haven't gotten yeah. a single cutscene since I woke up. Uh, and then we did this, did, we did this electric thing. And then we yeah. went in here. It unlocked this for us, so we were able to get back to the first district. Unless I need to kill the enemies in here. You can try it. Mailbox? Oh. oh. Oh, yeah, the mailbox twitched, uh, didn't it? It did do a twitchy boy. Mm. I even pointed out and said the mailbox looks mad. Yeah. And I, we just ignored the mailbox the entire time. Well, because then enemies attacked me and I got distracted. And I think I was talking about the world ends with you or something. I don't know. Leave this area? Yeah. Yes, please. Let me out of here. People are probably getting so mad at you. me at this game. This, <laughs> this, this is the worst I've ever done it knowing where I'm going. Just, just. Just give them a break. That's all I say. <laughs> oh, thank you. Where the it's hell am new. I? This is cool, though. Oh, so I go back office. up. Okay. It says post office on the sign. It's like a giant sign above your head. It says post office. I was office. facing the other way when I asked. This oh, is wow. Oh, God. This looks I... like Monsters, Inc. to me. I was going to say... Uh, you know, you're right. I, well, I was going to say it's stupid. Cool, then don't say it. No, okay. <laughs> what are you gonna say? <laughs> I was gonna say, do you remember that bit in Polar Express when they're going through like the elf factory? Vaguely. It sort of looks like that to me because there's a bunch of. Honestly, they don't look like mail, it looks like gifts because of the way it's wrapped. Yeah, it makes me think more of the Grinch then. There's like a I mailbox avoid... in the, the Grinch. You don't like the Grinch? I, av I avoid the Grinch. That's my coworker's only Christmas movie he likes because he hates Christmas. Oh, what a Mizog. And he's a Grinch. <laughs> yes. He's also I, uh, a Mizog. <laughs> I don't I like Christmas. Like I like the stuff with it. Christmas music gets really old. Uh yeah. Christmas movies get very samey. Not really into Christmas movies. But um I like I like the whole reasoning behind Christmas and stuff. I think that's pretty cool. Yeah. That's pretty neat. Respectable. 
Uh, what if I smash into that? Does that do anything? It did! Oh, wow. Okay. Wow, you big brain. I guess so. Rampant what you, what, what you lack in directional, uh, big brain, you give up, like, you make up for it in this. In puzzles. Yeah. I was trying to hit that present up there. I don't think that's anything I can do. And just seeing stuff and being like, can I smash this? <laughs> 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 Ooh, that made my mind go to like... <laughs> Zombo sees, Zombo sees Aqua. Can I smash this? <laughs> oh, no. Why? You didn't even just say it. And as soon as you uh, said where my mind goes, I was like, oh, no. Yeah, I don't know. It's a valid question. Because I have to get up to that beam thingy. Yeah, the green one. Yeah. I just fired you in the face. <laughs> what was funny about that? Um, it's a very in-depth image, to be honest, and I don't know if you want me to explain the entire thing. Uh, it sounds like a lot of work, so I'm just gonna move on. Yeah. <laughs> it won't be funny to you, just let me find it funny. <laughs> yeah, I kind of accepted that, so I'm like, yeah, no, don't explain it. <laughs> I'll, I'll save my time. We'll go up yeah. here. Should I just hop over to that yellow one? I don't know, can you? Oh, God, I thought you came a... in on the yellow one. I'm on the yellow one now. Oh, you came in on the orange one then. <laughs> oh, so this is a different yellow one. No, it isn't. Oh. oh. It was a different yellow one than the yellow one I just saw. Why are there multiple yellow ones? <laughs> uh. Because puzzles. Yeah. Going up? Maybe I need to read the signs more. Maybe that'll tell me where to go. No, don't go that way. Go the other way. Sora just <laughs> bumps into wall. It's been so, ten years. They find him just bumping into the wall. <laughs> it's been ten years. Yeah, like he just stays there for ten years, just doing no, that. No, no. We don't want that. Look at that. Oh, I'm back to the B. I did come in on the yellow. Oh. I guess this Th is the yellow. That's orange. <laughs> You, you've called two different colors the same name. Were they not both the same color? No. Let me see. Yeah. That's not orange, by the way. It looks if, orange. If anything, that's like a mustard color. I guess it's that I'll one. Lean, I'll lean towards mustard a bit more. I might have a nice Oh, this, this is more of a yellow. Screen. You're right. This is a different yellow. Has that been the source of my problem this entire time when we look at colors? Is that I have a slight night filter on my screen? You have a what? A night filter. It makes the blue light less harsh so that you don't hurt your eyes. Uh. Maybe? I don't know. What, I'll turn uh, it off in what? between episodes and we'll see. <laughs> probably. Honestly, probably. I got it. I got it. Hold up. Uh, what is happening? I'm trying to get up to this platform. Here we go. Hey, well done. Because this is where it was telling me to get the chest. So it showed this know, in the cutscene. I know. I just I was very confused at the screen switching back and forth so quickly. It didn't come through quite right. <laughs> I was like, what, what's going on? Uh, was there anything up here then? Other than Maybe. enemies? Yeah. Yeah. That doesn't seem to be. This game is going to take me a while to freaking know what the heck's happening. Okay, so I can break those boxes down there with one of my magical things. I don't see anything up here that I can do, though. All right, let's go over here, then. There you go. We can go like this. We can break these boxes. Maybe this yields something. Just a chest. Okay. Yeah, just some items just a chest are you kidding me i should probably equip some of this new stuff we got oh a chest did i miss i'm really bad at getting chests in this game <laughs> oh, to me, everything's new oh. you've got a lot of uh brain function going to how do i move, maneuver this map i do not like uh, flow motion <laughs> i don't like it very much either is there anything below the elevator actually maybe i'm thinking too uh <laughs> 
too too much like Elden Ring and <laughs> Dark Souls and stuff. <laughs> yeah. With that, have I been on this have purple you... track? Yeah, you were on the pop purple track. Have you been all the way on the green track, like all the way? Yeah, I thought goes. I went to both ends of it. I can. Oh, I mean, obviously you need to try some, something. I'm not doing right. So, well, the the top one led to this. This is where it ended. And I got on this from over there, from the yellow track. Nothing up there. See, we got here from the yellow track. And, and the, the yellow track the, has the, some splits as well. Oh, oh, I can, might be able to go through the tube. The tube. Rain, say tube for me, please. Tube. Yes. Say it with a little more chew in it. <laughs> tube. <laughs> All right, it's ma a tube on Tuesday. <laughs> on Tuesday. I chew the tube on Tuesday. <laughs> With YouTube. <laughs> uh, while watching YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I watch YouTube while I chew the chew uh, tube on Tuesday. <laughs> yeah. That's a great uh, sentence. All right. So I'm wondering if I go through here. Okay. God. Wow. This is taking every freaking brain cell to work this thing out. I'm trying to save. God damn you, Kingdom Hearts 3. Save the game. Here we go. Overwrite that save, I think. I think I'm fine overwriting that one. At, All least right. we found, at least we know where the end of the green thing is. Because I yeah. was wondering if it did go through the hole, but I was not sure. <laughs> I was like, I yeah, don't know. Did. I don't think... Guys, you guys let me know if there's a reason I should be doing these things. I, I cannot. I cannot be... I cannot care, I should say, <laughs> to do those things. Um, I like the outside of the post building. Oh, that's kind of cool. That's a look like a fire hydrant anyways what do you guys do you guys call them fire hydrants there uh yeah i think so i don't okay. know how to call anything else okay i'm gonna break this i think box it's right. meant to look more like a post box because it's over here post box are really red look sort of like that it's a bit yeah, different at the top ours are blue so that's wrong. That's wrong. This is America. Any only America's correct. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, our um, because of their Royal Mail post box and stuff, they have like ER on it for when the Queen was around. They're not gonna bother changing them now that the King's around, but. <laughs> oh. Oh, I thought it would. Uh, ER just made me think of the hospital. Like, what do you need to go to the ER for with mail? Is that like a? Do you write letters to the ER? Be like, hey, thank you so much for making me stay alive. Because it's um, Elizabeth Regina, I think. Regina? Is that what you just said to me? Yeah. Regina? Like, trust me, I, lo I laugh too. Don't, don't worry. Like vagina? <laughs> <laughs> trust, me. trust me. The first time my dad said it to me, I laughed. And I was like, he's uh, like, seriously? You're laughing at that? Absolutely. <laughs> It's like a, the male version's like Rex or something. Rex? Yeah, it means something royalty. I don't really know. It's, I just know what my dad's told me. I don't really pay attention to the royalty. It's a, it's a dinosaur, apparently. <laughs> That's what I said. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like we're on the same page with those two things. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah, they won't, they won't change the mailboxes. There's still some with a GR on it from... Uh, Elizabeth the Second's father, so. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, maybe it was his father. I don't know. Or his father before him, or his father. Spark dive. I like the spark dive. Spark? Let's try spark. I figured I should try some new commands. Yeah. yeah. I, wish I, I could... honestly forgot you had a command board. I know. <laughs> like I, command. I didn't miss not having all my commands yeah. slots yeah. available, but... Back to that. I like this area. It's kind of nice. This, I'm gonna say, I did. I, I genuinely had no idea that Traverse Town was built out in this game. As I said, I've never played this game, so I had no idea. It's and got a nice um, heart fountain and some I, designs on the floor. I love this world even more than I already did. I yeah. will be honest. This is this is amazing. It's gorgeous. <laughs> I, I I still like Twilight Town better than this world, but I. I think this one's really cool. This one's very, um, I think it's very fitting for a dreamy place because it's very whimsical. Yeah, it's also opinion. nighttime, like all the time. Yeah. It's the right time to party, Rain. Nighttime's the only time. Nighttime's the right time. 
I've never been to a party, like, like an adult -y one, so I don't know. I went to parties as a kid, but they're not the an, same thing. An, an adult -y one? Yeah, like, you know, like, teenagers, college yeah. students, they all go to parties. I don't do that. I don't it's do that either. <laughs> and the only party I remember that I last went to was like, uh, the oh. one that pops into my head is a birthday party and there was watermelon and I was very unhappy. God, you ain't freaking watermelon. It's like good. It. It's sweet. It's yeah, I mean, watery. Your your opinion's valid. It's valid. I disagree yeah, with just, you, and you're wrong, but it's valid. It's a valid opinion. Just like no, just like your opinion about honey gemelin is valid. It's... No, that's right. Yeah, no. Yeah, no, there's a, there's right answers and there's it. wrong answers, Ryan, and yours are wrong. No, I disagree with it, and to me it's wrong, but to you it's right. So I'll, like I'll respect it. That's how this works. <laughs> One of us is mature. Yeah, me. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, I. Everybody's entitled to their own opinion. I know, you just like doing that bit where you're like, mm -mm, you're wrong. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Can I like shoot up with this? Come on. That can. I, it's like a bidet. It can just shoot up your butthole and it shoots you up, right? That's not how a bidet works. <laughs> Unless Sora is really dirty and in need of clean. I don't think you should be entering the fountain speed A. You don't think my butthole needs to be cleaned? I haven't, unless Sora pooped his pants or something, I haven't seen him take a bathroom break, so not currently. Or a bath. Yeah. I haven't yeah, seen him take a bath. bath either. It's probably pretty <laughs> gross. I'm gonna be honest. I could do like, I could do like freaking climbing on the roofs. Oh, you Assassin's Creed? Feels like it, a little bit. You know, murdering things. I got my. I'm gonna drop soon. <laughs> Sora just falls asleep on a roof and slides off. <laughs> no. He becomes Santa Claus. <laughs> from the Santa Claus movie. Did Sa I have no. I don't think I've seen that movie. With with uh. That guy. Helpful. Alan. Steve. Al Steve. Tim Allen. Tim Allen. Not Steve. His name's not Steve. No. I've not seen that one. All right, I've seen it. A good few. I don't think I could break those. No. no I thought I would try it. Of, they're part of the environment. And yeah, they're used to climb up. Exactly. They're climby crates, not breaky crates. Yeah, I like my breaky crates. I I I, I know technically normally I'd wrap up the episode now, but I know that we. we Ran around doing nothing forever, and I don't feel right ending the episode <laughs> for that very reason. Oh, this is kind of cool though. I kind of like this. Yeah, that's a nice mood use of flow motion. No, come on! Oh, no! Oh, 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 oh! oh God. Yes, yes! Come on, come on! Oh yeah! Oh. A perseverance. <laughs> Spec raid. Well done. Or spark raid. Sorry. No, no, you I want the chest, I want the chest, I want the chest, before I drop. <laughs> nice. <laughs> falls asleep with his hand in the chest. Uh, no! Why is that water balloon Mickey Mouse shaped? He's gotta be branded. But he's not even here. Droplets 38, all right. Uh, just the decelerator's fine. That's cool with me. So I could, I could apply multiple of those things if I wanted to. That's kinda cool. Oh, good. And I'm right back here! All right, let's go up this way this time. Whee! This is kind of cool, too. I like this. Yeah. Sl sliding up water. Makes sense. No, it doesn't. It makes sense. Accept it. Reek is a badass. It makes sense. I don't question you my boy Reek. I'm not questioning Riku. I'm questioning the game. <laughs> I know. You didn't want to put him in S tier in the last game, so... Mm. I, I question how much I, you really like Riku. I don't know. It just, because I didn't even put Sora in the S tier because I was like, well, they weren't already in it, so I wasn't ranking them based off of that. I was ranking them based off of that game. I did too. They weren't in. They were in that game. And they like a had tiny a very bit. good. I, I literally convinced you to put them in S. Yeah, no, I agree with you now, but I'm just. I'm also defending my original opinion. <laughs> I don't know why. They, I don't they know had such why. a pivotal thing. They did. It was very important. Those scenes in there is, is is why future stuff happens in future games. So incredibly important. Very important. Indeed. 
It's the origin story. <laughs> which, which I guess, um, well, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll talk about it right now. So, so with the whole terrible explanation of Vanitas, Ventus, all that, those four characters, Jazz, just yeah. so I can make amends in a video instead of like telling you on the side. It, so I'm gonna re-explain it. Well, actually, tell me what you understand from it first. What, what do you understand it to be? From what I understand, um, Ventus, like, needed his heart mended, and Sora's heart reached out to his heart, I'm guessing because they were both on Destiny Islands at the same time, and mm -hmm. mended it. And then, uh, Vanitas started to look like Sora because of that, and then because Ventus takes place in Sora's heart, and he's sort of still there, I guess, that's why Roxas looks like Ventus, because... When his heart split, it took the look of Vent. Like, it took the look of Ventus instead of Sora. Yeah, yeah. I say I think that's a, that's a very good general synopsis. However, some people don't agree with that theory. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm, I'm glad I, I I edited it in post, right? And I'm like, all right, well, this I could have explained that better, but you know that gets the point across um, by the end of it. And clearly, I did a fine job because you explained yeah. it to me in a in a fashion that, you know, gets this, gets the premise across from a very general stance. Um, however, apparently the general community doesn't necessarily see that way, and I... I took the last week, literally, thinking nothing but this, and creating my own well-developed theory, where I went on a multi-paged <laughs> Word document, and formulated this theory, and and I talked with Jaden about this, so he was able to rebuttal certain things about my theory, and then I was able to then explain why those things were actually, you know, not a problem based on my yeah. theory. Um, yeah, I think he did like, say something about him having a problem with your explanation. I was like, I don't... Is Ombo going to talk to me about it? I don't know. <laughs> yeah, and so... Um, I, I did. I went through this whole thing about it, and so I, I have a huge thing about it. Which, if you guys are interested, I, I suppose I can make a video on it sometime, um, and I can do this whole thing. Otherwise, I'll, I'll give like a, a more brief synopsis without all the rebuttals of like, well, well, anyway, how, how would this work though? Uh, with, without some of that. But anyway, so so my explanation to you, I've kind of come to the conclusion that no matter what happens, there has to be some kind of a retcon with the Vanitas bit, why he looks like Sora. I, I cannot. I've thought about 75 different ways. I cannot think of a reason why he would look like Sora when that happened before Sora was even in the picture. And so I just, I'm accepting heart connection there, which is the the brief explanation I gave you. And that um, he didn't have a form. I'm just going to accept that now, that he just didn't have a form prior to that. Because I think it's the le least retcon-y thing I can think of. And the thing we have to retcon is the fact that we heard Sora's voice in the Keyblade Graveyard. We yeah. just have to say that uh, that was just uh, oversight of the game devs or something. Or something that they changed by the end of the game. I think it's just the least intrusive thing that we can do. And um, so I'm just going to accept that. So we'll say that's why. But still heart connection. It's still a heart connection thing. Because... Yeah. Vanitas and Ventus are part of the same whole, right? So yeah. one one is half of the other, you know, two heads of, sides of the same coin kind of dealio. Yeah. So it, yeah. it makes sense in that regard. And um, so then Sora connecting in was kind of like, think of it like how uh, Roxas looks like Ventus, right? It's, it's, it's yeah. that, but the other way around. And so it's kind of it's yeah. interesting like that. Uh, so that aside, we'll, we'll say he was formless beforehand, and he did that whole shebang. I'm gonna give you both the theories for the next part because that is where I don't see eye to eye with. It seems like a chunk of the community, but it also seems like a chunk of the community aren't happy with that explanation. So I'm gonna provide you guys a new one, <laughs> which makes okay. way more sense to me <laughs> than the bullshit I'm about to explain to you. <laughs> no, no. If, if you guys like that theory, I I, I can respect it. And I, I see some of the... It, it seems like a stretch. A very big stretch, but I can... A lot of stuff in this game seems like a stretch, so whatever. Yeah. Um, but anyway, so we're going to cut to... I guess the end of Birth by Sleep, right? We have Sora and 
Ventus coming together, right? Because Ventus is in disarray after his fight with Venetus and his heart, so his heart's absolutely, like, all over the place. Okay, good, no cutscene here. Um, so, he, he joins with Sora, right? We're on the same page. Yeah. He's, he's in Sora's heart, yeah. and he's, through, he's in Sora's heart through KH1. Yeah. So, the theory that was given to me, and I think this is really the main reason why I quote-unquote explained it terribly. Um, you didn't is, explain it terribly. Well, thank you, Rain. <laughs> as far as I'm concerned, you're the one who, <laughs> your opinion matters because I was explaining it to you. <laughs> no, you explained it very clearly and I, I understood everything perfectly. All right. Thank you. Um, is that Ventus didn't stay with Sora. He went, he left Sora because he was, he went to a, the darkness, right? He became a heartless. So he yeah. went to Roxas's body because he needed a safe place to be. So he went to Roxas instead of instead of Sora. Um, and so the reason why Roxas looks like Ventus is because Ventus was literally in his heart, you know? Yeah. Which nobody's have no heart. So why yeah. does he have a freaking heart and all that stuff? But I mean, whatever. It's it's not like that far fetched because then we're like, okay, well nobody's grow a heart. So I mean, apparently hearts are a thing that movies can have. Whatever. Yeah. Um, and so then they're like, okay, well, that's why there was like, he could wield like two Keyblades because Ventus was in his heart or whatever. And, um, and all that. So yeah, basically. And then that's why. And then at the end of KH2, or sorry, beginning of KH2, end of Roxas' storyline, when he joins with Sora, then Ventus obviously joins back with Sora too. So then he's mm -hmm. back with Sora. Now, the, the fact that, like, Ventus goes and just finds Sora's nobody, I mean, you can say he just rode his body with him and, and found Roxas, but here, here's my biggest gripe with this theory. And I'm, I'm yeah. still on the theory that, that Ventus was with Sora that whole time. I don't see a reason why Roxas, or sorry, not Roxas, Ventus couldn't go with Sora into the realm, to the heartless darkness. Because here, here's the other thing, right? Is that he, uh... He was able to maintain consciousness in his heartless form, Sora was. So, was he yeah. really, like, overwhelmed by the darkness? Could he have still, like, been, like, sane in his heart? Which it seems like he was to me if he had control. Yeah. Like, I feel like it would be fine in there. Not to mention, like, the fact that Shion and, and Roxas can both wield the Keyblade is, is, from my understanding, most people are just like, it's because Ventus and... and uh, Sora, both can wield a Keyblade. And so, the fact that Roxas is the only one with Venetus in his heart, because Shion doesn't have Venetus in his heart, in her heart, it's only yeah. Roxas then, and she's siphoning memories from Roxas about Sora, which is why he loses the ability to lose, use a Keyblade. So then, why does he ever lose the ability to wield a Keyblade if Ventus is always in his heart? You make a really good point. Not to mention, and here's here's my biggest, the biggest thing right here, which has to do with his heart stuff, is the yeah. fact that Ventus had a body. His body wasn't the problem. He didn't need a body to stay safe. He needed a heart to stay safe. That's why yeah. he joined with Sora's heart, not his body. So why would he go to a nobody who is literally just a shell to stay safe? That makes no sense. Yeah, he could just go back to his body. Well, he, I was, that was something I brought up. I'm like, then why wouldn't he just go to his own body? It's in literally the safest place ever. Castle of Living, no one can get there but Aqua. It could not be safer, but it was, and I'm like, all right, yeah, you're right. He, he it, it was established that he can't find his way back without Aqua. Like, you need Aqua to find it. So I'm like, okay, yeah, he wouldn't go to his body then. So that part okay, was yeah. rebuttaled, but I, did, I had the same thought process. So you're on the right track. Good job, Brian. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, so it's like, it's, it's, I, I think it makes way more sense for him to be in his heart. And, uh, yeah, I, yeah. I, 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 I don't think there's a problem with him being in the heart, especially because yeah. it was so brief. And then Kyrie brings him back together. Yeah, also, like you said, he was still in complete control. Right. And, and then, um, you have the, the argument that was made too, is that Kyrie only had a connection with Sora, so she wouldn't be able to bring Ventus back, but. But Ventus is attached to Sora's heart. Sora, yeah, he's attached to Sora. So you bring like, Sora back, you bring Ventus. And Yen said, kind of talks like he's like f floating between 
light and darkness. Like, he's just kind of floating around, but he's floating around in Sora's heart. Yeah. So, it's like, you can't really pull him out of his heart. If you're pulling Sora's heart out, it's like, imagine you're in a box, right? The box is Sora's heart. Ventus is inside the box. If you pull the box out, the thing inside the box is coming with you. Yeah. It's it's not like some separate entity. Like, okay, fine, her connection to Sora is what brought him back to light, but Ventus was just, like, along for the ride for that. He's just there, too. Yeah. Anyways, there, there's my theory, everybody. <laughs> In a brief standpoint. You guys, I, I want I wanted to list both there because you guys I, you guys can pick if the other one makes more sense to you. Go for it. If you guys think that he shouldn't be able to come from darkness, fine. But and I mean that's the cool thing about this game is you can have your own theories and we don't have to fight about it. But it's cool to have a discussion about it. It's well, kind of fun. I, I think he could come from darkness personally. I oh. I have a I have a problem with him being in Roxas's heart. <laughs> What's that? It just it doesn't make sense to me. <laughs> It doesn't make like, so much sense to me. Like, I, the way he gets there is like he rides his body. It would be my explanation for that is that he just follows his body there and sort of gets released. But mm. it's like, I, I know it doesn't diminish it technically, but the whole fact that like Roxas grew a heart is so yeah. impactful and like that he already had a heart in his body was like, meh. Yeah, you're like, dwindling like I don't like that. Roxas's purpose. A little bit to me and and some i i can totally see the argument that like that doesn't he still grew his own heart on the side so it doesn't it didn't really impact him at all but like i don't know i still don't like it and i think that's yeah. okay <laughs> i think it's okay not to like it whoa okay well, that's cool it's yeah. okay not to like it <laughs> so yeah i just wanted to throw that out there i wanted to make sure i explained that in video I've very, I've much i've had much contemplation about making a separate video about it explaining these <laughs> theories um, but I have not decided if I will or not yet. No, but you didn't... I, your original expo uh, explanation to me was perfectly fine. I understood, and I was like, okay, so Roxas is still, like, a separate entity that, like, did that, and Ventus just... He just looks like Ventus because of being in Sora. Like, they made perfect sense. Yes, and... Uh, oh, here's the other thing. Here's the other thing. I know this episode's really running really long, and I'm just kind of running around, but hopefully this guy... This is interesting to you guys. Um... The other thing was the explanation that I think that I kind of just came up with is the fact that um, Naminé is nobody, right? Half is Kyrie, half is Sora for Naminé. Then you yeah. can say the other half is Sora and and then half is Ventus for um, Sora's nobody. Yeah. I mean, I think that could be kind of interesting. And yeah. I, I don't think that that has any negative effects on, oh, well, but we see that Roxas has a lot of clear strong connections with Sora, obviously with memories and stuff, but Naminé had a very strong connection. She could manipulate his memories. <laughs> like, yeah. I don't think half would diminish that. So, I, I could see that being the arguments against that situation, but... Yeah. But you're gonna have to remind me where Xion came from, because I'm having a hard time remembering. Xion was, Xion was the memories that uh, Naminé pulled from Sora about Kairi in oh. Chain of Memories. Right. So that's her little connection there. Everybody Sora! Everybody <laughs> Sora. Fuck. You were so serious about that when you said it. When you first said it, I was like, what? Yeah, and we've only got more characters for a Sora. <laughs> oh, this everyone is Sora. So there's that. And I'm not like, I'm not gonna die on the hill that, oh, Roxas is only half a Sora. Like, I, I'm not committed to that at all. I just think it's an interesting theory that I wanted to share. I'm completely cool if he just looks like Ventus because Ventus was in Sora's heart. I'm cool with that. Yeah. <laughs> I'm cool with that explanation too. I just I just thought it was interesting. I wanted to share that. That was um, interesting. Thank you. But yeah, so I guess I hope you guys enjoyed that. I know we went a little long. I know sparks will get cut here, but um hopefully it was all all interesting stuff and I'm going to attempt to wrap my brain around this game a little bit more. Now that I know that the yeah. map lies, I think that'll help moving forward. I think Traverse Town is probably going to be the most complex world to go through. It seems like there's mm. a lot to this world. I don't know how big the other worlds are, but I feel like this is really big for a world. So it's I guess, very big. Yeah, I, I, I guess we'll see. So, But anyways, guys, thank you all so much for watching. Feel free to let me know in the comments down below what you guys think of the theories. If you guys agree, disagree, let's have a discussion. Let's not be aggressive towards one another. It's much more enjoyable if we talk about it. But anyways, guys, thank you all so much for watching, and we will see you all in the next one. Bye, everybody.